Hey y'all, it's Lindsay. Welcome back to my channel. It is the most wonderful time of the year, so the song tells us, and that also means it's time for the Trader Joe's winter haul. Now, let's be very clear, this is not a budget haul. <laughs> uh, I do like to do budget hauls, but not when it comes to Trader Joe's winter items because they are my favorite and I wait all year for them. So, let's dive into the goodies. All right, let's just go one side to the other. First, we have scallopini potatoes, which we love scallop potatoes in this house, so this is probably going to be a hit. I haven't had this before. Uh, eggs, nothing seasonal about that. Steak and stout pies. Now, can we just talk about this for a second? Because I travel to the UK a lot for work, and this is my favorite thing to eat while I'm over there. So I am so excited to be able to bring a bit of the UK to my house. I also have beef shepherd's pie, which is a seasonal, um, well, I don't know if it's a seasonal item at uh, Trader Joe's, but shepherd's pie I only really eat in the winter, and I absolutely love it. Creamed greens, that's going to be Brussels sprouts, kale, and Parmesan cheese, which that was new. I hadn't seen that. Also new, truffle powder seasoning. And if you know me, you know I love truffle. So having truffle powder to season whatever I want to season is just excited. Uh, just makes me excited, I should say. These, perfect bars dark chocolate and peanut butter. If you have not had these, oh my gosh, you are missing out. These are so delicious. Highly recommend them. We also have cauliflower gnocchi. This is from the fall haul, but they still had it and I want it. The holiday vegetable hash. It's really good in like a frittata or you can just put it in scrambled eggs or you can put it like if you're roasting, uh, like doing a Sunday roast or something like that. It's great. Um, also, I need balance in my life, so I got some cold pressed juices. There's both green juice and red juice. Let me tell you the ingredients. We've got kale, spinach, apple, cucumber, celery, lemon, and ginger. That sounds delicious. For red, we've got beets, celery, cucumber, carrots, apple, spinach, ginger, and lemon. So I haven't had the red one before, but that seems like I would like it. It looks delicious. Um, speaking of red things, I am trying to eat more of a variety of colors in my diet, and I haven't been doing a very good job of it. So I got some radishes and some baby beets that are, you know, ready to eat. I figure I can slice them up and put them in some um, salads or things like that. This I got last year, the camembert, how do you say that? Camembert, Cam camembert, camembert cheese, camembert cheese, I don't know. I think it's French, we'll go with cam camembert, camembert cheese and cranberry sauce. These are so delicious. So I got two this year because you know, I made the mistake last year of only getting one. So now I have two. Also got this last year, wine country chicken salad with white chicken meat, cranberries, and pecans. It's such a seasonal flavor and it is so good. You need to go get some. Also got spinach and kale Greek yogurt dip, which I have never had before, but I have some leftover like tortilla chips and I needed a dip to go with it. And that seemed relatively healthy. So that's, that's what we went with. My favorite dressing of all time, the toasted sesame. Dressing from Trader Joe's is amazing. Organic garlic non crackers, um, also to dip in the um, chicken salad. This I'm not gonna be able to pronounce, so I'm still gonna try, but beef en croute, maybe? I mean, it sounds fancy, we'll go with that. It's beef and mushroom in a puff pastry. Mm, so, sounds amazing, never had it. I th hopefully, it, I think it's new, but we'll see. Spicy pumpkin curry sauce. Now I got this, this is from their fall line. Um, I made a vegetable, or sorry, I made a spicy pumpkin pot pie, curry pot pie using this, and it was so good. It's perfect for winter, so I got some more. I will make sure that that video is linked up in the cards if you would like to see that. Um, I got a trio of almonds. It's caramel coffee almonds, sesame honey almonds, and roasted and salted almonds. So that sounds delicious. Roasted rosemary boneless chicken breast. Um, just an easy, quick meal. Sounds amazing. Scalloped cracker trio, because we definitely like bread in this house. Egg frittatas. If you have seen any of my grocery haul videos, you know we really like eggs. I actually bought five of these, or four of these. Um, figure a quick, easy breakfast. 
works for me. Then I've got veggie burgers. It's black beans and uh, roasted corn. These are delicious. I have never had Belgian endives. But I told you I wanted more color in my diet and there's some purple in there, so great. But also I'm trying to eat a variety of different vegetables and like I said, I've never had Belgian endives, so I got those. Oh, can we just talk about this beautiful piece of, I don't know, art. Uh, truffle pecorino cheese. Now, if you know me, you know I live for cheese and I love truffle. So the two combined, like, oh, we're just gonna be best friends by the end of the day. I can promise you that. Chocolate covered pretzel twist assort assortments. This is where we start getting into some of the fun holiday items. I don't really like pretzels all that much, but you dip anything in chocolate and better believe you have a friend for life. So I'm gonna try these. I got some cookie mug hangers for the hot cocoa bar. Ravioli, so this one's for Jared. Sweet Italian sausage for cheese ravioli. I mean, I would like that too, but I love mushrooms and Jared doesn't. So I got the porcini mushroom and truffle, uh, duh, truffle ravioli. And then like I said, I got Jared the sausage one. I love focaccia bread, so I got focaccia bread mix. Hopefully it tastes like I'm a baker. We got some candied walnuts. I really try to eat seasonally. And the easiest way to do that is like just with your food, right? So walnuts are in season in the winter. I just had pumpkin seeds in the fall. So I just try to like switch up whatever I'm eating to match the season. I feel like it's usually cheaper, but also um, supposedly it's healthier. So I'm just gonna keep going with that. Brown rice and quinoa pasta, uh, just again, to be a little bit healthier. Told you that I like truffle. So we got some white truffle popcorn. Back over here, hiding, we have organic sliced apples. Uh, what else? Let's move all of this stuff so you can just see a little bit better. Um, I got these last year too, I love them. Boozy little chocolate truffles. <laughs> like Honestly, I kid you not, they carded me to buy this, which um, one, super flattering, thank you, but two, uh, it must be a lot of alcohol if you're gonna card somebody for this, but fun times. The peppermint pretzel slims. Now these I had last year and they were so good that I bought two bags this year because you cannot run out or you will be very sad. These I bought for stocking stuffers, these three and these three. Um, this is just a festive chocolate collection. Sorry, I think the lighting glare is pretty horrible for you. So there we go. Just little cute things. I got three of those and then I got these are um, Belgian truffle box, and they've got an assortment, and they're wrapped and very beautiful, so I got three of those. There's six people in my family that are gonna need stocking stuffers, so six boxes of chocolate. And finally, last but not least, I got some hand soap and lotion that is Trader Joe's White Pine. I think this was new this year. I haven't actually smelled this scent yet, but um, you know, I like pine, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it. And there you have it. That's the haul for today. Lots of seasonal goodies, some old, some new, and I cannot wait to dig into them. There you have it, my Trader Joe's winter seasonal haul. I got some tried and true goodies from last year that I absolutely loved. I got some new stuff this year that I cannot wait to try. But if you watched this video in full, you will see and probably guess that I will be gaining a lot of weight this holiday season and I am not even mad about it. I am here for all of this yumminess. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and make sure you subscribe so you can see future videos that I put out on my channel and I will see you next time. Bye.